What is metabolism? The innumerable chemical processes that take place inside your body are referred to as metabolism. They are essential to your survival. Metabolic activities in living organisms include respiration, movement, detoxification, and biological functions including digesting. Additionally, it's essential for protecting vital organs and replacing tattered tissues in your body. A lot of fuel is required for metabolic processes. Your body won't be able to produce that much energy for them to function properly for too long. Fortunately, your body possesses enzymes that act as cheat sheets for these reactions. These tiny molecules speed up metabolic operations by lowering the amount of energy required. What kinds of metabolic processes are there? There are two broad groups of metabolic processes. Let's look at the many categories of metabolic processes below. Anabolism. The term, anabolism, describes the metabolic processes that create big molecules. To move them, energy is needed. Your body needs biomolecules to function, which are produced via anabolic processes. They are also carried out by your body to conserve energy. The process of converting glucose into glycogen for storage is a prime illustration of an anabolic response. Catabolism. Through catabolism, your body can disassemble complicated substances into simpler components. For example, the substantial protein you consume is divided into smaller amino acids. Catabolic reactions frequently release energy, therefore you get energy from the breakdown. What makes metabolism significant? The process of metabolism is crucial to life. Here are the top 5 justifications for why metabolism is essential. 1. It breaks food down. What happens to all the chicken, fries, and chips you eat in your body? Metabolism. Your digestive system is where it all starts, as enzymes break down these complex nutrients into simpler components. This indicates that simple fats are formed from lipids, while complicated proteins produce amino acids, glucose, and carbs. These tiny units can be absorbed by your body. They travel to your liver and other tissues after entering your circulation. 2. It releases energy. You need to process the more basic food components you obtain during digestion to turn them into energy. Food breaks down completely to produce CO2 and water. Additionally, they create ATP, which serves as the basic fuel for all bodily functions. 3. It also stores energy. What does the extra energy in your body do? The quick response is to save it for later. The extra calories are either stored as fat or glycogen by your body. For this, there are anabolic processes and metabolic reactions. When your body requires fuel, later on, the energy reserves come in help. 4. It produces essential molecules. For your body to work properly, several other biomolecules are required. Nucleic acids, signal molecules, hormones, and enzymes are a few essential components your body need. They come into being as a result of metabolic activities. 5. It helps remove wastes in your body. Many bodily functions result in wastes that, if they accumulate, could harm your health. The metabolic mechanisms in your body allow you to get rid of these pollutants. For instance, your body turns hazardous ammonia, which results from the breakdown of amino acids, into urea, which is much less toxic. Detoxification of toxins from various sources is accomplished by metabolic processes. How fast is your metabolism? Metabolic rate is what is meant when someone uses the word metabolism. Your metabolic rate is the amount of energy you consume during a given time frame. How can your metabolism be boosted? Your health may be impacted by an imbalance in the metabolism of your body. Your metabolic rate rises, causing you to burn more calories and maintain your weight loss. On the other hand, a slow metabolism might make you feel lethargic and make it difficult for you to control your weight. Can you take action in this regard? Absolutely. The following list of five all-natural strategies to increase metabolism. Start exercising. Exercise moves your body, which increases calorie burn. The quick bursts of physical activity required by high-intensity interval training, HIT, consume more energy. They might work wonders for boosting your metabolism. Eat more proteins. Following a meal, your metabolic rate slightly increases, giving you the energy you need to break down your meals. The effect is greater for proteins and is referred to as the thermic effect of food, TEF. Drink cold water regularly. 
replace your sodas with a refreshing glass of water to reduce your calorie intake. Additionally, your body expends more energy warming the cold water to your desired temperature. Get a lot of sleep. Your metabolism will suffer if you lack sleep. It has associations with several different health issues, including diabetes. Adults should aim for up to 7 to 9 hours of sleep per night, according to experts. Build your muscles. If you have more muscular mass, you'll expend more energy. To develop powerful muscles, start using weights in your training regimen. In conclusion, metabolism is how your body carries out its operations. Metabolic processes are involved in bodily functions such as digestion, excretion, detoxification, and biosynthesis. If your metabolism is sluggish, your body uses fewer calories. By working out, getting more rest, drinking cold water, consuming proteins, and developing your muscles, you can crank it up. Thanks for watching.